over to the master's next section that is price list. So just select price list. Here what the usage is that various prices are selected and set it under various levels. So here I just can give the product group and here I can just select the pricing level in which level you are going to set. And here different batches will be there. So according to the different batches, same products will can be uh, set with different rates or different products can be set with different rate according to the batch number. So the different price will be here. So I am giving the pricing level here, product code can be given and the details of that. So if you just go to the price list proper, you can see the details of that product and price level. So I just selected the batch number, batch details and just fill the rate and just save it. So it saves successfully. So in the list it comes according to this batch, this rate is coming for this product. So if you want to just update it, the amount or batch or something, just double click to it and just update it. So you just press update button, so it will be updated successfully. And next, that is how just we uh, enable that button price list. So entering price level. So if you just press it, you can just enter the pricing level. They will be having different levels. So according to different levels, you can just set the price. And under you can see different products, different rate. And here you can see the details of the product according to its pricing level and batch. And after all the changes, you can just save it. So under you can see the details, the newly set one. If you want to just delete, just select it and just press delete. So it will be deleted successfully. So here I am just giving different variations in the product.